Bonjour, hello, and welcome to my channel, Sarah Sierra Tarot. I'm doing a reading today for Capricorn. 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 If you have Capricorn in your sun, moon, or rising sign, this reading may be for you. Capricorn. Okay, Capricorn. I'm going to first light some sage spirits ancestors and guides please guide me today so that i may provide a message for capricorn let no evil spirits enter into this space that mean me or capricorn any harm angel of god my guide and dear to whom God's love commits me here, ever this day be at my side, to light, to guard, to rule and guide. From simple stain will keep me free, and at this hour my helper be. There's some sage for you too. All right, Capricorn. Let's see what's going on with Capricorn. First card we get is taking shelter. The answers are within. Looks like you got a lantern there. Valiant courage, taking action with passion. You're going towards some kind of it's like a circus tent. You got your flag. Crossing bridges. It's time for healing, connecting, mending, and releasing. So Capricorn, it looks like um, You might be looking within and getting ready to say, take some kind of passionate action. And you're ready to cross some type of bridge so that you can heal something and release it. Oh yeah, Capricorn. Because the next thing you have is cleansing waters. Purification activates vibrant life force. So Capricorn, you're really looking within yourself and wanting to take some kind of action and heal something and release it. And you, you want to cleanse something out of your life. And underneath that card was transformation. You want to transform a fresh new way of living to a fresh new way of li living. In order to do that, you're gonna have to cleanse something out of your life. And you know that the answers are within Capricorn. Um, it just requires you to take some kind of action. And it's time for you to do that healing work. Okay, Capricorn. Let us see what's going on with Capricorn. First card you get is strength, overcoming something toxic, having courage, could be dealing with a Leo, page of cups, Capricorn, some type of apology, 
Maybe you're getting the courage up to give some type of apology to somebody. Looks like you're trying to mend something, heal something. You need to cleanse something out of your life. You're getting the courage. You're getting the courage to do something. You've been out in the cold feeling like you're like out of something. You've been left out of something. You have this key to get into this door, Capricorn, but you're choosing not to go in there. And now you're trying to get the courage to cross that bridge. Yeah. Make an apology. You're thinking about making an apology. What's the situation with Capricorn? A tower. Something is crashing down. There's sudden abrupt change, Capricorn. Three of swords, a broken heart. It's also a timing card, something in three days. There's some sudden change happening in three days. Capricorn. Something is suddenly happening in three days. King of Pentacles. King of Pentacles um, could be an earth sign, a husband, stability. Looks like there's some kind of sudden change that has happened that broke your heart. And it could have to do with a husband. Hmm, Capricorn. What's the outcome here for Capricorn? Page of Wands, a passionate message. Six of Pent Pentacles. And this right here, the Six of Pentacles, is showing like giving and receiving. Maybe giving and receiving passionate messages caused a broken heart. And then we have the wheel is a Sagittarius card. Capricorn, you actually showed up in Sagittarius's card reading. I might want to check that out. Um, hmm. Capricorn, maybe you're getting the strength and the courage to apologize for not being present for something that you've been dealing with some type of broken heart. There's been some kind of sudden change that's occurred that's affected your stability. And you're ready to send some pass passionate messages back and forth, maybe with a Sagittarius, or this is fate and destiny happening. But I think you're getting the courage to clear the air about something. And underneath, you have the King of Cups, which is mature love. King of Cups could also be, I think in this case right here, Capricorn, this has to do with mature love. And you're getting ready to mend something with somebody. Okay, Capricorn. Why is the strength card here? The moon, secrets. 
why is this apology page of cards cups card here oh, some some kind of secret that was going on over the internet some spying going on over the internet why is the five of pentacles here eight of pentacles hmm Something to do with your work, Capricorn. Being left out in the cold about work. Some kind of secret communication going on. Some type of apology needs to happen. Tell me more about this tower. The star could be dealing with an Aquarius, or it could be wish granted. Healing, healing from some sudden and abrupt change that broke your heart and had to do with a husband or stability. You're healing from that tower moment, these secrets, Getting the courage to talk about some kind of secret communication that was going on while you were at work. Then you have the Three of Swords here, which is a broken heart. And then you have the Five of Pentacles, which is about staying Staying out of some type of situation that's been going on. Maybe you've been healing for five years. You've had this broken heart for five years, Capricorn. Why is the King of Pentacles here? Ten of Swords, betrayal. Yeah, you're definitely healing from some kind of broken heart that you got from this betrayal that happened five years ago, I think. Maybe it was you that broke somebody's, did some kind of betrayal. And you're finally getting ready you're, to take action and heal something, mend something. You want to cleanse this energy out of you. Tell me more about the outcome for the Page of Wands. Ace of Cups had to do with some new love. Why is the Six of Pentacles here? King of Swords, clarity. You're finally getting clarity about some kind of new love, this passionate message that was going back and forth. Why is the wheel here? There is an ending. Some type of ending, this new love, these passionate messages that were going back and forth some type of Sagittarius. You're getting some kind of clarity about it. And you're looking within and wanting to clear the air about something. And underneath the duck, we have the Six of Cups, which is nostalgia. Nostalgia maybe about a soulmate, somebody you knew from your childhood. Yeah, you're ready to clear the air and purify yourself, Capricorn. Okay, Capricorn. Let's look at um, let's look at some advice for you. Well, first. We'll look at some blocks. What are the blocks for Capricorn? What blocks are there for Capricorn? Nine 
Knight of Pentacles. Slow and steady. Something has been really slow. Page of Swords. Spying, stalking, communicating over the internet. And Queen of Cups. Hmm. Use your intuition. This could also be feelings, emotions. Your feelings and emotions have been blocked. Capricorn, this could also be your intuition is getting blocked by some kind of something that's slow and steady that's been going on, communicated over the internet. Or your feelings are. What's some advice? Page of Cups again. Needing to apologize about some sneaky behavior. Seven of Swords. In a tower. Something that crashed to the ground. Capricorn. What else does spirit want you to know? While you were feeling abandoned, it's the five of pentacles or staying out of something, taking care of the lame Capricorn. There's temperance. That could be a Saggy card again. Capricorn, and justice. Something to do with the court. You being stuck out in the cold, maybe with this Sagittarius, there's a, some kind, something in court right now, something is coming into balance. And you have here the Nine of Wands, leading others through a storm. Something that you've gone through, Capricorn. Healing from some type of betrayal that left you out in the cold. You got left out in the cold, Capricorn. And you had to gain some kind of balance, get some kind of, you were patient. You got angelic help here. Temperance is about patience. And now you're finally getting justice. Capricorn. Wow. There's definitely some kind of tower moment going on right here at Capricorn. I'm going to get some clarifying cards here. Because it was really unclear to me what this block was. Maybe it was a Queen of Cups that was blocking your communication. Slow and steady, the spying, this Queen of Cups was spying. What are these blocks? Why is the Knight of Pentacles here? Capricorn. Two of Cups. Hmm. 
maybe an accountant. Knight of Pentacles can be an accountant that was blocking your equal love partner. Or maybe, maybe the Knight of Cups could be another Earth sign. Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn. Why is the Page of Swords in the blocks? Having to put up boundaries, defending yourself from something that was communicated over the internet. Or something that was communicated over, yeah, something communicated over the internet. And then you have here, lying, cheating, sneaky behavior with the Queen of Cups. Hmm, maybe there was some lying, cheating, sneaky behavior using your intuition about this equal love partner. Capricorn. Why is the Page of Cups here in the advice? What's this apology about? The Fool. Taking a leap of faith and making the apology. Why is the Seven of Swords here? You got some sneaky behavior going on here that looks like you need to clean up. Page of Wands, a passionate message. Some kind of passionate message, or it could be a young fire sign. No. This is some kind of passionate message that you need to apologize about. That caused this tower. What was this tower? The chariot. You need to take some kind of leap of faith about this passionate message that led to some lying, cheating, sneaky behavior. And victory will be yours over this tower moment. Because the chariot the chariot right here is victory, success. Yeah. Or maybe by taking this leap of faith and this apology, about revealing this lying, cheating, sneaky behavior that was going on with these passionate messages or this young fire sign, you're going to get victory over some kind of establishment or some, some sudden abrupt change. But it's time for healing, connecting, mending, and releasing. What else does Spirit want Capricorn to know? You have here the Queen of Pentacles, which is mothering, nurturing energy. And then has and then getting balance after some kind of secret. You got the moon card here twice now. There's some secrets going on. Why is the Justice card here? And then we get Temperance, which is Saggy Energy, Angelic Help. I think, I think you might be dealing with a Sagittarius that, and there's some secret going on. Some secret that left somebody out in the cold. 
you, them, somebody got left out of the cold. There was a tower moment that happened. And now there's justice. Justice that's going to happen after some secrets revealed. And we get here the Knight of Cups is underneath. Some type of love, love action. You have all the tools. The Magician. And the Ten of Wands. It's time to lay down some type of heavy burden. When looking at this, this tower moment, you're healing from it. Your broken heart about your stability, getting stabbed in the back, being left out in the cold. There's some secret and you're getting the courage. You're getting the courage to come forward with an apology about some kind of spying, stalking, some kind of communication that happened at work that caused somebody to be left out in the cold. You, Capricorn, feeling left out in the cold. And it had to do with your work, some kind of secrets at work. It's time to cleanse yourself. Take some courage. Mend this situation. It's been a long time coming to make this action. Okay, Capricorn, looks like you got some work to do. Hope that was helpful. Bye, my peep. See you later.